How's it going, guys? So this is a better demonstration of this effect. I actually just turned it off, so it's going to climb back up to about 28, 12, 28, 13, I think is where it was at after about 8 or 10 minutes of rest. But um, I'm going to demonstrate uh, the unit with no recharge engaged, powering that light bulb and the draw. So there's 28, 12. And uh, we'll turn it on right now, and we'll show you the draw. We are 27.86 and dropping, and we're pulling 86 watts, 85 watts, and that bulb is bright. Um, I'd say it's pretty close to full, but meh, pretty close. Uh, so 20, 27.79, and uh, now we're going to hook on the recharge. You can see the brightness the bulb dropped whoops now that dropped all together because I shorted that I knocked that off there we go the, the brightness dimmed but uh, our recharge 2797 and we've got say half the light and half or so a recharge going back in here um, so if I could balance my load uh, maybe a little less load and force a little more recharge so that the battery actually gained then I could siphon off of this all completely free maybe charge a second battery and charge the supply battery at the same time uh, I think just by maybe like trying a different wattage bulb or something that's 100 watts I'll see what I got but uh, just a clear demonstration of uh, pulling 100 watts uh, with the recharge engaged, ever so slightly dropping. If I disconnect the recharge, the bulb goes to full brightness. We're actually pulling less watts, 84 watts. And uh, our draw, you can see it on the battery, dropping fairly quick. We'll let it drop a little more. If it's, yeah, see, it's dropping fairly steady. Uh, kind of what you'd expect, 80 some watt draw. And, uh, yeah. I'm going to hook it back on here and you can observe. So 2773, hook it back on. The bulb goes dim. Uh, 2790, 91. 82. It's going to find its uh, balance point there and then probably slowly, slowly start dropping. Uh, one digit approximately every 15 minutes. So a small solar panel would keep this thing topped up and you'd always have this high frequency battery charger running. Or like I said, balance the load. Take a little less out of here, force more out of here or find a different wire arrangement. That maybe works better. I, I'm still experimenting, but uh, there you go. 2794. 100 watt draw and uh, close loop.